Did you know there are currently more than a million and a half Canadians who are unaware that they are living with diabetes? And according to Diabetes Canada, that number is actually expected to jump by 25% in the next 10 years. With November being Diabetes Awareness Month, there is a new campaign that is making it easier for those in the GTA to get themselves tested. So joining us to talk more about the initiative is CEO of Dynacare, Vito Ciceretto. Thank you for coming in today. Thank you, Melanie. It's great to be here. Let's talk first about type 2 diabetes. It impacts millions of Canadians, and there are certain parts of the population that have a higher risk. Let's talk about who they are. Absolutely. It does affect certain um, uh, parts of the population to a greater extent. Um, those that come from Asian, South Asian, Caribbean um, uh, ethnicities, black, um, uh, Indo um, uh, countries are, are more highly predisposed, twice as high as the average person. And if left untreated, undetected, so as we gave that figure there, some people might not even know. What are some of the complications? Because I don't think everyone's aware of how serious this can be. Absolutely. And, and also that it's, it's very preventable and very manageable if you detect it early enough. But if you don't, it could lead to very serious um, cardiac type issues, um, uh, kidney um, failure, um, in you know, worst cases, amputation. Uh, and, and also, you know, it leads to significant complications when it comes to flu or things like COVID-19. Mm -hmm. So the key is to uh, detect early, right? Um, Absolutely. But there is a specific test, and I don't think everyone necessarily knows about the test, which is covered by OHIP, but you, through Dynacare, are doing a campaign with Diabetes Canada to make things simpler for those in the GTA to get themselves tested. Uh, let's talk about this campaign. Absolutely. So the campaign starts today. November 1st and goes to the till December 6th. Um, Dynacare shoulders and, and essentially absorbs the cost of this campaign, where normally OHIP would pay for this test. Uh, we try to make it as easy as possible. So you can go a number of different routes. You can go to your family physician and say, I'd like to get an A1C test. Uh, and you can take that requisition, come to one of our 60 collection centers across the GTA, mm -hmm. and you can get tested. Uh, but you don't need a, a requisition. You can also just walk into any of our collection centers or our mobile testing clinics that we're, we're, we've got four of them set up. The whole month. The whole month. Mm -hmm. And you can just come in without a requisition and just say, I want an A1C test. Okay, and what does this involve? So an A1C test, it's a, a, very, a relatively simple procedure, minimally invasive. So uh, we, would, we would draw blood from the patient. Uh, it's one tube. Mm -hmm. uh, our technicians are highly trained, and so they're very good at it. So they make it very, very painless. We would take that sample and we would have it tested in our certified laboratory right here in Ontario. And how long would it take on average to get those results back? You'll, you'll get those results within the day. Uh, this is not necessarily a new campaign. I know you've done this before and I was looking at some of the stats and this, was, this one stood out to me. Uh, you did approximately 86,000 tests of this A1C test. Uh, and of those 86,000, 60,000 returned abnormal results which required a medical follow-up. That speaks volumes. It does. Um, so do you have a, a, you know, advice to people who are watching and say, maybe I'll, I'll put it off, maybe I don't need to. W who should be looking now? You named certain uh, segments of the population over a certain age as well. Sure. Right, over 40? Over 40, um, you know, if you haven't been tested. Um, if you're um, overweight, if you're obese, you should be tested. If you've got high cholesterol, you should get tested. Mm -hmm. um, or if you don't have any of those and you're just curious and you want to know whether you, you know, you're diabetic or pre-diabetic, sure. um, we encourage people to get tested. It'll take just a few minutes and as you mentioned, there are numerous locations plus these pop-up clinics and mobile clinics. If people want to learn more, what's the website? Dynacare.ca. Beautiful. Uh, all That's the information easy. is right online. Vito, thank you so much um, and uh, hopefully people can learn more as well because I think this is something that we need to be aware about, especially when we see these facts and figures. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you, Melanie. It's great to be here. Appreciate it.